And a couple months ago, we spoke with a prominent community member who was selected to participate in SIU's model sponsorship program for patients that get the chance to model over in New York's Fashion Show Week. News Channel 20's Kyra Willis has an update on this year's patient as they prepare for treatment. Kyra? District 186 school board member Erica Austin was diagnosed with breast cancer in June. Since then, she has gotten the opportunity to model designs from the Ana Ono clothing line in this year's New York Fashion Week. I spoke with her about her experience and how it has prepared her for radiation treatment. It was definitely an emotional experience, but it was one that I needed. So, uh, for healing purposes. Erica Austin says walking in Fashion Week was an experience she will never forget, saying she felt empowered by hearing the stories of breast cancer survivors walking in the show with her. And I saw some who had, whether it be a lumpectomy, whether it be a mastectomy, bilateral, er everyone was just happy about, you know, their decision and they own it. There's no judgment. Erica's doctor, SIU plastic surgeon Nicole Summers, says she was very proud to see a patient of hers be so confident while on stage, saying it was exciting to see Erica be such an inspiration. I know she was really nervous before doing it, so to see how she did was pretty incredible because she really, she really rocked it. I mean, she turned around and danced all the way back, which was pretty cool to see. Erica's message to all breast cancer patients is to be proud of who you are and don't let the disease define you. Encouraging patients to be fearless, live your life to the fullest, and always keep a positive mindset. Own it and be proud of who you are. Um, don't let this take you down. There's things in life that come and they go. And this is one of those things where I can let a dark cloud overshadow me or I can live my life and I'm choosing to live. Last week, Erica started treatment at HSHS St. John's Hospital. She will undergo radiation daily for 20 sessions. She expects to be done by October 30th. In the studio, I'm Kyra Willis. Back to you. Thanks, Kyra. Now, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. It aims to promote screening and prevention of the disease, which affects one in eight women in the U.S. every year and more than two million women worldwide.